first on Local 22. More money will address Vermont's nursing shortage, particularly in the Northeast Kingdom. Local 22's Jolie Sherman reports tonight from Lindenville about the two schools getting a grant to expand their nursing programs. Knowing the region's nursing shortage, Vermont's congressional delegation helped secure more than $240,000 to give students here the education and training they need to join the healthcare workforce. With current nurses retiring and Vermont nursing schools graduating only five to 600 nurses each year, we are actually losing ground. Senator Bernie Sanders joined other members of Vermont's congressional delegation at NVU Linden to announce the effort to make a nursing education more accessible. Right now, nurses are in high demand. Today, we have 27 openings for full-time nursing positions. Sean Tester is the CEO of Northern Vermont Regional Hospital, and he's working to fill another dozen positions at his facility. The grant works to address this gap, starting in the classroom. This expansion creates as many as 60 additional seats that we can teach in both practical nursing and registered nursing. It'll also transform an entire hall into three lab spaces, equipped with hospital beds and IV pumps to provide hands-on training. Nursing students say the expansion will better prepare the state's future frontline workers. Nurses definitely are the backbone of the healthcare system. If we have that sim lab, it will give us that opportunity to experience that so when we do get out on our own, we'll know what to do. And this work continues in Washington. Senator Sanders says he, Senator Leahy, and Congressman Welch are working to increase funding for the nursing corps and secure half a billion dollars. Reporting in Lindenville, I'm Jolie Sherman.